Hey guys, Karasif here with another review. This time I'll be reviewing the Deluxe King Lion Dai Senki Wonder Ride Book from Kamen Rider Saber. This is a special Wonder Ride Book that lets Kamen Rider Blades power up. So, let's get started. First up, we'll look at the King Lion Dai Senki Wonder Ride Book on its own. This is a large navy blue animal type Wonder Ride Book. That's a continuation of the Lion Senki story. So, once again, this has its own unique shape to it, with a pretty interesting looking cover. For comparison, here it is next to the original Lion Senki, where, like Dragonic Knight was to Brave Dragon, it's bigger in all respects. You can see that, like the difference between Brave Dragon and Dragonic Knight, they also have the same title font with a similar gradient, gradient to them. So for the cover page, we have the title in English, as well as the Wonder Language. And it actually depicts this kind of mechanical lion with a pair of shoulder cannons that are firing off into the air. We've got the indicator for what slot goes in, as well as Kamen Rider in the, uh, well, in the Wonder Language. For another comparison, here it is next to Dragonic Knight. As you'll see, they're about the same size. Though obviously the way that they're stylized is quite different. And you can see that for the part that goes into the sword driver, for uh, Dragonic Knight it's shifted off to this side, whereas for King Lion Daisenki it's here in the middle, and that's to accommodate for what slot they're supposed to go in. It also has this interesting piece sticking out the top of it that looks something like an antenna. And while this doesn't have much purpose here as a Wonder Ride book, it will be more useful when we use this with the Sword Driver. So, like with Dragon Knight to activate the tile announcement, you have to use this sliding up button right here in the back. And we'll open up to the story page, where it's looking a lot more like a more traditional standard Wonder Ride book. So, here we have the title in the Wonder Language, and then we have the same mechanical line that was on the cover. You can also see a bit of a line face peeking through this part here. So this does have a few parts labeled. You got the sword, the cannons, and then down here it just has the word line repeated over and over again along the tail. Like with the other two big books, this has three synopses. And like with Dragon Knight, the cover page is also spring loaded. Though interestingly enough, the string is so strong, the st spring is so strong rather, that when you let it flip open on its own, that'll also activate the uh, page push. Next, we'll use the King Lion Daisenki book with the Seiken Sword Driver and Sui Seiken Nagare, and like with Dragon Knight, I'll have the belt strap attached to uh, counteract the weight of the book.
Instead, we get the transformation into Kamen Rider Blades King Lion Daisenki. Now, with this one, unlike with the Dragonite Knight, where the book expanded out from one side, in this case, it had a double flip open. So, for it had the cover page fold open, and then the inner page fold open to reveal the transform tension page. And so this thing basically has King Lion Daisenki, or at least the form, depicted on it. So we now have the head, which has this kind of cybernetic visor. And you can see that this part up top actually becomes the sword tip, you know, the kind of blade horn that comes out of Blades' head. We can see the line face embed on the chest, as well as one shoulder can here and his left arm that's going out to this side. It has this interesting little device on his wrist that you also saw on, well, a similar device on Dragonite Knight when you looked at that. That's not something we're going to look at until later. I did say, or rather I didn't say, but there is different writing on the inner cover compared to other ride books. But what is more of note is this rank here on the side. So, it says, Rider Mode. Mecha Lion no Chikara de Power Up. Which is Lion Mode, obviously, even in this part says, Power Up with the Power of a Mecha Lion. And then down here, it says, Kata no Cannon de Tekio Ichimo Dajin. Which means, you just use the shoulder cannons to wipe out all your foes. So from here, we can do a couple of attacks. First, if we push down on the card page twice, similar to the Dragonic Nightbook, that will activate, in this case, the King Lion Hisatsugeki. Then, we put back in the sword, push on the cover page and draw the sword. It'll give us the King Lion Hisatsugiri. Then we can get to the final gimmick of this book, which has to do with the uh, part up top, which is called the sword trigger. So, you can see that there's a little slot down here. And so if we take this, then bring it down, then push down on it, that's going to flip out one more page. And so with this, Blade's King Lion Daisenki transforms from Rider Mode into Lion Mode. Here we can now see that the visor has combined with the Lion. We have the sword now down here. And you also have claws here as well as outer claws here, basically showing his front and back legs. And then we have Suiseken Nagare here in his mouth, which actually extends out and into the part that we send it down, so it all connects into one image. And then the ring here changes to where it now says Lion Mode. And the ring down here says, Rider ga Lion ni Henke. Ken no kuate teki ni osoi kakaru. Which means, the rider transforms into a lion. Include a sword and charge down your opponents. So like this, we can also activate at least the uh, first attack.
However, if we put back in the sword and try that with the Satsukiri. <clears throat> Nothing happens. Additionally, in order to change it back to rider mode, the cool thing is that if you once you uh, unlock it from this part down here, this page actually flips back into place. And we also activate some attacks through the uh, Seiken. So we get a Hisatsugeki from the sword and it reads it as Kakuseishita Dobutsu, or Awakened Animal. And also, we can do an alternate method of activating the King Line Hisatsugiri. Finally, we can also use the King Lion Daisenki book with the Ankokuken Kurayami. In this case, it reads it as Giant Animal. We can also use it with the Caliber Driver to activate the transformation. Unfortunately, the placement of the speaker doesn't quite match up with the holes on the caliber driver, so the sounds get a little bit muffled. And there we go! So once again we have a unique big book with its own unique gimmick. In this case, instead of expanding out or being a pop-up book, it flips open in two ways, and in this way we have this mode-changing book for a mode-changing form. And it's quite clever how it takes what is the horn on the blade's head and then makes it the sword in the line mode's mouth. And it does have some similar functionality to the Dragon Knight book, since they are meant to be pretty similar to each other. But it also has its unique style and taste, so it does have something interesting to offer. I can definitely recommend this if you have the Seiken Sword Driver and the Sui Seiken Nagare set. Next time, we'll be getting to a uh, much-requested item where I'll be looking at the UR Watch Custom Bezel. So, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. And if you're new and would like to see more, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. And for now, this is Karo Sifty, riding off.